Chicago police seized weapons and narcotics in enforcement missions on the west side to stem the tide of gun violence in the city's most dangerous neighborhoods. The narcotics and vice missions also resulted in the arrests of 77 individuals. Officers targeted specific areas in 11th and 15th police districts based upon feedback of aldermen, community members, historical crime incidents, known locations of narcotics sales, vice complaints, and known areas of street gang activity. I made a commitment to hold offenders that contribute to violence in Chicago accountable and that includes how they fund their criminal activity, Chicago Police Superintendent Eddie Johnson said in a news release. These initiatives show CPD's continued effort to strike gang-related operations from every angle to reduce the violence being committed in some of our neighborhoods. The number of individuals that were arrested in this mission with previous gun offenses shows a clear need to impose stronger sentences for repeat gun offenders. Johnson said two of those arrested were charged with unlawful use of a weapon. Of those arrested, 45 of the offenders are documented gang members, 53 of the offenders received enhanced charges of selling narcotics within 1,000 feet of a school, 57 are previously convicted felons, 10 of the offenders are on parole, 17 have been previously arrested for gun charges. 63, or 82 percent, of the total offenders arrested are listed on CPD's strategic subject list. This list is an algorithm which calculates the propensity of an individual to be a victim of gun violence in their lifetime. This score is based upon previous contact with police, known affiliations with gang members, and geographic location, the police news release said.